Hey guys, it's TennisSys.com here with a really cool tennis product. It's the Pocket Radar. It's a radar gun that fits in the palm of your hand and in your pocket. It only weighs 4 ounces and it's very easy to use. It's a perfect training tool for any coach or tennis parent. Um, I received it from PocketRadar.com and I took it out to the tennis courts to see just how hard I could hit my first serve, second serve, forehands, and backhands. So as we open it up, you can see there's this very easy to read how-to guide on how to use the pocket radar, how to set it up, how to install the two AAA batteries, and where to position yourself when measuring the speed. You can use it for other sports as well, baseball, volleyball, soccer, riding a bicycle. But as you can see here, tennis, because that's what we're here for. Let's take a look at the pocket radar. It comes in a really neat carrying case. It's very durable. It, would, it fits perfectly into your tennis bag, um, so it doesn't get any damage. But like I said, it fits in the palm of your hand. It's very small. It's lightweight. It only takes two AAA batteries. And there's only two buttons. The big red button is to initiate measuring the speed. And the black button is to recall the previous speeds. Very simple. Not very complicated. And it's pretty easy to use for the most part. I spent some time with this pocket radar on the tennis courts measuring myself and my friend's serves. Uh, it did take a little getting used to as far as the timing goes because I was instructed to push the red button right as the tennis racket was going into the ball striking motion. So basically from the bottom up position to ball contact is where you're supposed to push the red button real fast. Um, so the timing was a little bit hard for me. I you know, eventually got it down, but that was that was the main issue that I had with this. Um, and, you know, going back through all the service speeds, um, these low numbers you can see aren't really service speeds. They're just misreadings. I've misread a lot or mistimed my, my radar reading quite a few times. And so I ended up with some low numbers. The 149 is definitely not me. I don't serve that hard. There's also a certain vanity to having a radar gun so easily accessible. It's definitely cool to, you know, make bets with your friends to see who can hit it the hardest and who, you know, who's the bigger server of the group. But it's definitely a really good training tool and it's very easy to use and once you kind of figure out the timing, it's one of the greater tools available on the market. And for more reviews, be sure to check out TennisThis.com.